Alright, this is Rick24205 here, and today I'm going to be doing a review on the Lego Ninjago uh, Spinjitzu Dojo. So, first thing I'm going to go over is the characters that it comes with. Well, first of all, it came with this Sensei Wu Spinner, which I'm going to do my special modification to later. Then it came with Sensei Wu. Now, he didn't come with the golden staff, but uh, since I already had, um, since I had coal, I got it and I bought the set that came with the um, scythe on purpose with coal. So you could have the scythe, so I gave Sensei Wu the golden staff. Um, and... Currently, I'm using him as one of my Spinjitzu characters, and uh, after, we're, after this review, I'm going to actually play with him for the first time. Um, next thing it comes with is some Sensei Wu uh, character card and Spinjitzu cards, but I'm not going to go over them, and I'm not going to go over his powers. Um... Alright, let me just uh, zip this zip up this zip lock here. Alright. Next it comes with Zane. Ninja of Ice and the only one of the four ninjas with the sixth sense. I found that out I forget how. Um and this is General Knuckle of the of Lord Garmadon's skeleton skeleton army. Now, let's take a look at the dojo, okay? So it has these axes over here. Um, and it also has these shootout things on both sides. Um... Actually, I was aiming over here so I could see it better. And now, let's move into the center here. So, behind these doors is... Straighten these swords out. Or, actually, I think they're supposed to be in one, like that, and like that. And now we open these doors up to reveal the shuriken of ice. Alright, now, let me set the scene here. Knuckle is walking up to the uh, um, shuriken all menacing like trying to steal it. But Sensei Wu and Zane can't get to him fast enough. So the shuriken has its own built-in um, defense mechanism. Yeah, bust the floor. Um, it does. It's supposed to do that. And then you can just put the floor right back there. And now over here to this side... It has these. Now, the ninja who dares to perform this task has to jump over these spinning katanas. And they have to try to do it all in one jump or manage to jump over one and then through the other without touching the blades. And then it has these cool uh, Japanese paper lantern things got these like Japanese dojo things um and it's also got these these are not stickers they were pre-painted and it's also got some ends right here that it looks like something connects to it and I think I know what uh connects to it I think it's the uh spinjitsu training grounds 
I'm not sure, but I think it's a Spinjitzu training ground since it makes sense. Since this is the dojo and they learn Spinjitzu in the dojo, it only makes sense that the training grounds would connect to it. Um, well, that's about it. Uh, Rick242, fight out. Peace.